Hey guys, um, just wanted to come to you guys to show you guys a basket I was creating. So I took a box that I got from, let me pull this out. I took a box that I got from Hobby Lobby during their Christmas. Actually, the box has the price tag on it. During, I'm going to leave that there. During the Christmas, 90% um, off haul, says it was $8, so it was 80 cents. I stuffed it with construction paper, put packing paper over the top of it, and then put um, tissue paper on top of the packing paper. Laid out all my items already. I decided to use this here, which is the perfume... Um, the stiletto perfume that you get from Rainbow, and they were three for ten. Thought those were so cute. Tanisha um, had showed a video where she had did the Rainbow perfume haul, and she got quite a few. I got some over there, um, and she showed us um, her haul, which I think. Uh, and then I went and got some. I thought it was pretty cool. Um, I liked the look of the perfume um so we're just gonna go in and start building the baskets i'm going to describe and tell you what i have as we place them in the basket first we are going to put our back on so i got this um from dollar general it says always love the color is red um and red is red signifies uh love it signifies, um, it also represents Valentine's Day, but we are going to, as much as possible, try to make this look like Mother's Day. So we're going to use this picture, and how we are going to hold up this picture in the back, we are not going to use skewers today. We're not going to use these. We are going to use, we are, we are going to utilize the rolls that we get from our cellophane rolls that we buy going to utilize this. Don't worry, you won't be able to see it because we are going to hide the construction of the basket. So we're going to place that in there behind, behind the tissue paper, construction paper, and it is going to be sturdy enough to hold this. So we got that in there. Okay, and now we are going to take this down. Excuse me what any type of tape you want long as this a sturdy tape so i'm going to take this down in the back i'm just taping the what is this the uh so cellophane roll to the back of the picture i decided not to take the picture out of the casing i'm gonna leave that You can take the picture out of the casing, but for this video, for this um, basket, actually, I want to leave that there. Um, so now we have this look in the back, but remember, we are going to hide that con the construction of the basket. You won't be able to see that. So we got that in there. And now uh, we are going to take, I took... Some towels that I had got from uh, Dollar General. I'm doing one of the 90% off sales. And I believe these were actually 20 cents. Believe it or not. So, and what I did was I wrapped them with the gold ribbon that you could, um, the gold ribbon and some jupe um, string. Um, I put the jupe string at the bottom and you won't be able to see that. After we place all our items, we're going to use another towel. You will be able to see the gold, though. Place that in there. Um, we are going to be using the L'Oreal conditioner and <clears throat> shampoo that we got from Walgreens. Um, I had been telling you guys and urging you guys to go and do the Walgreens deal. Um, 
which made both of these, I think it was $1.56, somewhere in that range after you use, um, they had two digital coupons. One was a store coupon and one was a manufacturer coupon um, that was on the Walgreens app. Um, so it made both of these $1.50 something. So we're gonna place those in, one in front of the beach towel. Then we are going to, let me see here, cause I need to show you guys what I did. Give me one second. So I had got this during a Walgreens haul also. Walgreens is the store of my choice right now. But um, I got this off, got this from a 90% off haul. It was $12.99 originally. I got it for about $1.30. So what I did was I took and broke it up. It has socks, the foot cream, and the scrubber in there. So we're going to take, so I broke that up. And we are going to use that. I got the Dove. This has sticky on it. I got the Dove um, with the red top. And we're going to place that in there. Place these items. Okay. And we are going to, here's the socks that came out of there. Pretty long socks, very big socks. So we're going to fold those like so. Place those in there. And then it had foot cream that came with it. Here's the foot cream. I'm gonna place that right on top of socks at an angle. And I decided to use this box. Um, we are going to place this in between both of the towels. I'm gonna have to pull it down. Like so. Okay. And I am going to, while I'm doing this, I am going to take this box down to the back of the picture. Um, this tape will not ruin the picture at all. But I just want to make sure that this basket is tilted to the side. This won't fall. Okay. To get the stiletto on here, I am going to use glue dots, not tape. Put one on the heel. If it comes off, put one. So I'm placing it on the part of the shoe that I think is going to come in contact with the box. Place that right there. So it looks like it needs another glue dot because what I thought was going to come in contact is not. Hmm. About here. Put two in there. So that's on there. And I got it going in the same direction as the shoe. I think I want this box to come up a little bit more, a little higher. So what I need to do is a couple things I could do. And finish utilizing this, which that's what I think I'm going to do. So I just need a little height. Just a little height. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And let me get some tape. Be right back. 
I'm going to tape these two um, together, these two ends. I don't know what you would call those. Uh, give me one second. Honey, yeah. when you get a chance, can you order me a um, tape dispenser, a large tape dispenser um, thing for this tape? Yeah. I know one of your distributors probably sell them for this packing tape because I am having a problem here for real tape, for real. Could not find the end for real for the life of me y'all I cannot find the end of this tape but I want to use this tape not even right with my finger oh here we go I think this is it I guess I won't be using that tape I wanted to use that tape though, but it's okay. I actually didn't even have to use tape, but I make sure these don't roll around. Okay, so now we got that. Awesome, 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 awesome. So uh, I wanna go in and make sure it's extra secure. I can't even find my regular tape. This is crazy. Huh. Okay. I guess we want to make sure it's extra secure. I think it won't roll around. Um, no, I probably won't roll around. I want to lift this dove up a little bit. Now I could take packing tape, I mean packing paper, stretching paper, whatever my heart desires, but I think I'm just going to use another one of those. Awesome, awesome, awesome. It's sturdy. Awesome, awesome, awesome. taping I like the uh, Scott's 3M tape that you get from like you can get it from anywhere I got this from Dollar Tree um, not really sure if I'm going to ever get it from Dollar Tree again because the one from Dollar Tree, it, um, it's not easy to work with. Not for me. Not for me. Okay. So we got that in there. And we are going to place this one over here. Okay. And... That's pretty good. So we're going to place the socks in there. We are going to place foot cream in there. We're going to take the foot cream down. Here's the regular tape. We can see all our items. Pretty well. We are going to use, where's the loofah? We are going to use a loofah that I'm going to embellish with a butterfly, a red butterfly, just to give it some pop, some zane. We are going to use this. It already has poo dots on it. <clears throat> I'm going to place that right here. It's already glued down. 
we are going to since we got this pretty good and I want to make sure the sock and the foot cream don't move so I'm going to place it let's see here I can do this just want to make sure that don't move Actually like the placement of everything in here so, to ensure it doesn't move we are going to make sure it doesn't move that includes the loofah so we got that So, and now, um, I decided to make, since this basket is going to be, um, a little hot on the high end of price, I wanted to give it an elegant feel, and the beads definitely gives it an elegant feel. I had embellished the box with the rose, um, sticker that we get from Dollar Tree. That comes on this sheet. They're dollar twenty-five, and this these beads I had got from Dollar General. I think it was a Valentine's Day um, sale, ninety percent off. So I had receipt got that. So we are going to place this behind here, and it and it gives it that. Oh. With this um, bead, I guess, wreath, um, it didn't come with this pink flower. But in order to tie this wreath and the rest of the basket in together with the rolls on the front of the box, I went in and I placed a flower that's similar to this just to tie it in. The color scheme is a brown, a tan, and brown and red with a little bit of gold I'm also going to place in a tan face mask Let's see if we can get this in here so it doesn't really matter where you place this um, really don't matter I like all my items to be seen but if it's not seen that's that's fine I think I think yeah, I think right here will be good. I'm going to straight wrap this. So yeah, I think that's a good place for that. And I can actually um, put a glue dot or a piece of tape. So. And this is the ribbon that I use to um tie the see how thin it is what is this it is three eighths by 12 feet 9.5 millimeters times 3.6 m i don't know so yeah i got this from michael's i think i got the celebrate from michael's um during one of the one of my shopping sprees. So, place it right up here. Oh, and we're going to use brown shred to, to tie the red and brown natural look in. So, we're going to just put some shred in there. Put some shred all the way around.
has a little red mixed in. Put this all in here. Let me make sure. Sides, yes. Okay, so we got that in there. And I think we should secure the beads. Uh, and this beads had this beads the beads had a string, which I'm going to take and secure to the back up here, just so it don't fall down. I'm just taking it to the back. Okay. Give it an extra piece. Which isn't going to harm the picture. So I got that in there. Straighten out my little flowers. Make sure I can see my beads. I think that came out nice. Gonna go in and wrap it. You guys, give me one second. <laughs> 